Well, temperatures this morning are on the chilly side as we take a live look outside. Temperatures mm -hmm. currently into the teens and 20s, but the uh, winds are relatively calm, and that's why we have relatively calm conditions on the lake. Those calm conditions allow the temperatures to cool off and settle, but it may lead to a little bit of patchy fog in a few locations, especially northwest Indiana. In the meantime, we're going to take those teens and 20s, and we're going to see the numbers move up today, likely to around 40 degrees. There's our current temperature, 26 for O'Hare, but there's 18 for Aurora. I expect some clouds to filter back in after a little bit of sunshine this morning. That will get our temperatures into the 30s. We're likely going to stay there. It's the south wind that's warming us up today, not necessarily a lot of sunshine. I do expect near 40 degrees to be our high temperature today, um, probably in the 30s for most of the day. But again, the south wind, despite all of the uh, cloudy skies that stay with us today, tonight, and really the early part of tomorrow, it's possible we could see a little sprinkle or drizzle or maybe even a flurry mix in tomorrow. But most of the day, it's going to be kind of this off and on sprinkle, drizzle, light rain. Northwest Indiana may have a better chance at a few showers, but tomorrow kind of a dreary day, not necessarily a washout, but definitely a day that's going to have a lot of cloud cover and some drizzle in place. 42 though, so we do stay well above freezing by 10 degrees. 41 for Sunday, and then really over the next several days, we hold these temperatures well above the average high. 34 is the average. We're going to be in the 40s all the way through Wednesday, and that's when things may start to change. We'll take the temperatures that have been relatively mild with no big push of cooler air, getting up into the 40s almost every single day. And then as we get into Christmas Eve, watch the colder air begin to filter in. That'll bring some much colder air and we could see the temperatures get down into the single digits by Christmas morning. Still a long ways out though, still six or seven days to watch this, but it does look like a big cool down is coming for Christmas Eve and Christmas Day.